Hey, how's it going everyone? Welcome to Exploring with Russell. Uh, it's a beautiful fall day today and uh, there's a bunch of uh, trees everywhere that are turning gold. This is truly autumn and I love it. Well, as an annual tradition, I always pay visit to one particular residence here in Great Bend. And that would be the Halloween Inflatables House. It's become legendary in proportions. Let's go take a look at all the new things they put out this year. Each year it changes. And uh, they have some pretty fantastic inflatables out here. And they are really packed in tight. So let's go take a look at Halloween inflatables. Here we go. As always, we're going to start at one end and work our way to the other. Well, there's a lot of new things this year, too. I'll just kind of be your narrator here. Oh, look, there's Frankenstein. He's getting electrocuted. That's shocking. And, oh man, look at the big ghost. Wow. And check all these guys out, too. It's just pretty amazing all the stuff they have out here. Each and every year. And they got a little dirty this year. I noticed a lot of smudged dirt on uh, some of the inflatables and stuff. But that still doesn't damper the experience of visiting this unique and crazy place. Wow. Uh, giant kitty. And there's just a lot of stuff to look at here. Yep. And now, let's see what else they have out here. Look at the size of that snake. There. Amazing. And look at those two tall guys back there. Wow. Let's see if we can get a close-up of them. Yes, sir. There they are. And there's a pumpkin. It looks like the wind kind of blew that guy over, too. He's kind of laying on his back. Laying down on the job. And look at that dragon. Boy, everything changes every year around here, too. Oh. There's the giant rat in the trap. And, of course, uh, we have something new this year. It looks like a raccoon with a bag of Halloween candy. Trick or treat. Oh, and there's an elephant. And look at that scary thing. What is that thing? You know, it looks like, uh, I think he's a monkey, but I'm not sure. And there's a giant spider over here. And even a bigger spider over there. And let's take a gander over this way. Hmm. There's another one. Oh, that's a black widow. Look at the hourglass. Uh, don't you look at me, guy. I didn't do anything to you. Okay. This thing's got really super long legs. 
amazing. Oh, and they just go on that way too. You could miss the stuff in the back by just being out here looking at all the stuff on the front. Well, you never know what you're going to see in this area. And good old Charlie Brown, and there's Linus. You're waiting for the great pumpkin back in there. Here, let me get a little close-up of them guys. There they are. Yeah. Okay. Looks like some stuff has shifted around this year. Oh, and look at the spider with the top hat over here. He looks pretty cool. And there's a bat. Ah, definitely plenty of stuff to look at. Oh, and there's an M&M's with... I don't know if you can see it, but there's Snickers down in there. Oh man, that makes me hungry. Ah, look at this guy. Pretty cool. Now... I do believe this one is a fish. Yeah, pretty cool. And a lot of uh, famous cartoon characters too. Wow, pretty amazing. Either that guy there is a nervous driver or he's on a bumpy road, I suppose. Oh, and these all got pretty dirty out here, see? They're all kind of covered in dirt. And there's Olaf, and he's kind of dirty too. Well, it's been kind of windy today, so... And um, these were put up when the weather was kind of stormy. And look, there's the Scooby-Doo Mystery Machine with a ghost driving. Hey, what did you do with Scooby-Doo? Oh, look at that minion back there, man. He's pretty tall. Quite the minion. Oh, yeah. And there's, I seen him last year, there's the Stay Puffed Marshmallow Man. He's just about as big as you get. And Snoopy, I thought he rode a doghouse, but I guess he rides pumpkins too. And Happy Halloween from Mickey. These guys could sure use a bath. Look at this poor guy, he's all dirty and everything. And there's the Star Wars crew back in there. Oh, yeah. Oh, look at the Star Wars robots back there. Yep. Oh, there's Scooby-Doo. He slipped out of the mystery machine. And it looks like they stole the mystery van from him. He should report that, you know. And boy, I've seen more Mickey Mouses. How many Mickey Mouses are there, I wonder? There's another one. And, uh, uh, man, look at that big old green grinch. Oh, actually, it's the ghost from uh, The Nightmare Before Christmas, I do believe. And the, uh, there's Jack Skellington. It looks like he elbowed him and he fell over. Wow. And more of the Star Wars robots. Yep. And C-3PO. And hey, there's Woodstock and Snoopy. And there's Jack Skellington again. He's sitting on a pumpkin. And if you look back there, that cat don't look too happy. He looks like he's ready to pounce on somebody. Wow. Oh, and let's take a look back here. Well, there's just a lot of everything back in here, including some guy who's like shivering back there. Wow, pretty amazing. Okay. 
And now, we're going to take a look over here at this group of uh, stuff. They're playing Monster Mash in the background here. Oh, wow. There's a lot of skulls here. Look at all them skulls. Pretty amazing. Okay. Oh, there's Slimer. And Jack Skellington. And there's a little cemetery and a giant cat getting ready to pounce back there. And I guess what we have there is a giant bat on top of the... What is he on? Oh, he's on top of a trick-or-treat tombstone. And a vampire. And a peace sign from a giant skeleton hand. And... Let's see. Let me out. Dead as a doornail. Bye. Rest in peace and rest in pieces. <laughs> okay. Well, that's it for this edition of Exploring with Russ. I hope that you're going to have a great holiday season, enjoy the fall weather, and I'll see you next time on Exploring with Russell. Have a great day.